All right, all right. So we are back with another health talk. Today we are going to be discussing beetroot and beetroot juice health benefits. So sit down, relax, and enjoy this useful information as you receive them and put them to use concerning your health, beauty, skin, and all. Hello, Fierce Fitness family. Welcome back to the channel. So we have another. Okay, so we have another very healthy vegetable on the dining table to talk about today i will give you some of the health benefits of beetroot but sit back relax because we're going to break it down so you get all the information and know how it helps you health wise okay so let's start with beetroot juice may help to lower your blood pressure beetroot will also improve your exercise stamina for those that exercise we all need to exercise right okay and beetroot may improve your muscle power in people with heart failure beetroot may slow the progression of dementia it helps you maintain a healthy weight it may also help prevent cancer beetroot is a good source of potassium and it has a whole lot of minerals and nutrients that you need so let's dive right in as we break down step by step all the health benefits thank you all right so number one we have it helps lower blood pressure let's discuss that beet juice may help lower blood pressure research found that people who drank 250 milliliters that's about 8.4 ounces of beetroot juice daily lowered both systolic and diacetolic blood pressure nitrate a compound in beetroot juice that converts into nitric oxide in the blood and helps widen and relax blood vessels are thought to be the cause number two it helps to improve exercise stamina according to a small 2012 study drinking beetroot juice increases plasma nitrate level and boosts physical performance during the study trained cyclists who drank two cups of beet juice daily improved their 10 kilometers time trial by approximately 12 seconds at the same time they also reduced their maximum oxygen output number three it may improve muscle power in people with heart failure. Let's get into that. Results of a 2015 study suggest further benefits of the nitrate in beetroot juice. The study showed that people with heart failure experienced a 13% increase in muscle power two hours after drinking beetroot juice. Now, isn't that interesting? Let's dive right in as we discuss more benefits of this awesome vegetable okay so number four it may slow the progression of dementia according to a 2011 study nitrate may help increase blood flow to the brain in older people and help slow cognitive decline after participants consume a high nitrate diet that include beet juice their brain m RIS showed increased blood flow in the frontal lobes. The frontal lobes are associated with cognitive thinking and behavior. More studies are needed, but the potential of a high nitrate diet to help prevent or slow dementia is promising. Wouldn't you agree with that? Number five, we have it helps you maintain a healthy weight. Now, a lot of people will love to hear that. All right, straight beetroot juice is low in calories and has, virtual, has virtually no fat. Wow. It's a great option for your morning smoothies, for those that love smoothies. It will give you a nutrient and energy boost as a start, okay, for the day, okay? So number six, we have it may help prevent cancer this is also interesting let's talk about it beets get their rich color from bit uh well, from bitterlen which is a water soluble antioxidant according to a 2016 study bitterlen have chemo uh they have okay chemo preventive uh, abilities against some cancer cell okay all right so no okay Betulin are thought to be free radical um, 
oh, scavengers that help find and destroy unstable cell in the body. Number seven, good source of potassium. We mentioned this earlier. Okay, so beetroots are good source of potassium. Okay, beets are a good source of potassium, a mineral and electrolyte that helps nerves and muscle function properly. Drinking beet juice in moderate can help keep your potassium level optimal. If potassium level get too low, fatigue, weakness, and muscle cramps can occur. Very low potassium may lead to life-threatening abnormal heart rhymes. Okay, so consume more beetroot. Now we have more to discuss. Let's go. Now, if you're enjoying the information you're receiving, then please subscribe to the channel and also follow us on Facebook so the health discussion can continue. If you have any questions or any other video, any other fruit or vegetable you want me to talk about, leave it as a comment under this video and I will sure respond and make a video talking about that fruit or vegetable. Thank you very much. Okay, so we move on to number eight. Beetroot is a good source of other minerals. Your body can't function properly without essential minerals. Some minerals boost your immune system while others support healthy bones and teeth. I hope you know that, okay? Your body cannot function properly without these minerals. So, consume more fruits and vegetables. Okay, beside potassium, beetroot juice provides iron, magnesium, manganese, sodium, zinc, copper, and selenium. Okay, these are few. It is numerous, okay? Numerous to be mentioned, but these are few that I'm just giving you here. All right, so we move on to number nine. Number nine, we have beetroot is a good source of folate. We know that we all need folate, right? Okay, folate is a B vitamin that helps prevent um, natural tube defect, such as spinal uh, bifi what, bifida and, um, hmm, and, and it's cyclophil. I hope I said it well. It's a kind of defect, a kind of you know okay it may also decrease your risk of having a premature baby okay so yes if you're a lady you've been uh pregnant before you know that you're asked to eat certain types of food or consume certain types of fruits and vegetables sometimes they even support with pills you know tablets that uh will help you boost uh these uh stuffs okay so yes folate is something that you also need Okay, because nobody wants to have a premature baby, right? Okay, beetroot juice is also a good source of folate. If you are a childbearing, okay, like I, I just mentioned earlier, if you are of the childbearing age, adding folate to your diet can help you get the daily recommended amount of 600 micrograms, okay, of folate that you need. We move over to number 10. Beetroot supports your liver. Now, isn't that interesting? You may develop a condition known as hmm, nanoholic fatty liver disease if your liver becomes overloaded due to the following factors. A poor diet, excessive alcohol consumption, exposure to toxic substance, and sedentary lifestyle. The antioxidant betaine potentially help prevent or reduce fatty deposit in the liver. Betaine may also help protect your liver from toxins. Okay, so consume more beetroot and make it as juice, add it in your salad, and so on and so forth. Okay, because the health benefits, like I said, is numerous. Now, don't forget that there are various ways you can prepare your beetroot. You can consume it as juice. You can make it as a salad. You can boil it as a full meal. Any way, just consume your beetroot. That's the most important part, okay? All right, so let's move over to number 11. We have beetroot may reduce cholesterol. If you have high cholesterol, consider adding beet juice to your diet. A 2011 study on rats found that beetroot extract lowered total cholesterol and triglyceride and increased HDL on good cholesterol. It also reduced oxidative stress on the liver. Great. 
All right. Researchers believe that beetroot cholesterol lowering potential is likely due to the to the pheno to the phytonutrients. Oh, so the phytonutrients such as flavonoid precautions. We have to talk about precautions too, also, right? All right. Precautions. Your urine and stool may turn red or pinkish after eating beets. This condition is known as the beets uri. <laughs> it's harmless. However, it may be startling if you don't expect it. That's true. Going to the loo and seeing that your pool looks a different color from what it should be scares people because we all know what a normal stool should look like. But it is normal if you consume beetroot because of the color in it, it might change your stool and your urine okay all right so let's keep going okay if you have low blood pressure drink beetroot juice regularly may increase the risk of your pressure dropping to low monitor your blood pressure carefully if you are prone to calcium oxalate kidney stones don't drink beet juice Beet are high in oxalates such as natural occurrence substance that form crystals in your urine they may lead to stones okay all right next step beets are healthy no matter how you prepare them however juicing beets is a superior way to enjoy them because cooking beets reduce their nutrient value now we all know that when you cook something it reduces the value a little bit but when you're juicing it most people juice their beet fresh okay get it from the market wash it dice it you know into small small ways and put them put them in your juicer or whatever you're using that is you getting it fresh and you're getting all the nutrients and everything you need but yeah that doesn't stop you from making it as a salad or whatever but if you want the full maximum result then go for juicing instead of boiling steaming uh whatever okay so if you don't like beet juice straight up try adding some apple slices mint citrus or a carrot to cut through the earthy taste now that's one thing that makes a whole lot of people to not consume this very nice and healthy vegetable uh beetroot because people feel like beetroot smells like the earth you know like the ground similar to the snails they have very small a uh, strong smell of earth so people don't like consuming them so yes like i said add some slice of apple carrot and any other favorite fruit that you love mix it with your beetroot just to kind of uh, camouflage the taste so you can consume it to get all the health benefits if you decide to add beet juice to your diet take it easy at first Start by juicing half a small bit and see how your body responds. As your body adjusts, you can drink more. Okay, when you're starting something, don't just dive right into it with all your even exercise and everything else. You want to change your diet, slowly get into it so your body can adjust to it. But if you force yourself into it, then you, the reaction will be kind of huge. So slowly get a small bit, juice it drink it see how your body responds to it and then slowly get into the main thing and remember to mix it up with your favorite fruit so you don't feel that earthy taste and if you're making it as um a salad you want to add it to your salad remember to add things like the feta cheese and so on and so forth just make the plate look nice and interesting so you don't feel like oh my goodness this diet is boring okay and always have it at the back of your mind that the health benefits that comes with it is numerous so forget about the earthy, earthy taste or smell and just focus on all the health benefits and what you stand to gain if you consume this fruit and if you don't like it as a juice prepare it any other way that you love okay let's just check some other health benefits of this amazing vegetable okay so let's keep discussing it so beetroot help prevent signs of aging it helps to moisturize dry skin it helps to promote hair growth. It improves liver function. It helps to reduce inflammation. It helps to prevent cancer. 
it improves your stamina, it prevents dementia, it lowers blood pressure, it helps curing or helping with arthritis, it combats anemia, it helps to control with diabetes, okay? So like I always say, summing it all in one video won't just be possible, okay? Because the health benefit of fruits and vegetables is numerous. But I hope this few that I'm able to mention will help you or encourage you to go purchase your beetroots and consume them. It helps to reduce blood pressure, okay? Isn't that good? It keeps your heart in good shape. It helps to prevent cancer. Isn't that awesome? It helps to prevent uh, respiratory problems. It takes care of your eyes. It increases your stamina. It helps to uh, reduce bed defect, which is great. It helps to prevent dementia. Who wants that? Okay. It aids in purification of your blood and liver. Okay. Isn't that awesome? Purification of the blood and liver. It also takes care of your liver. Okay. So I'm, I'm just hoping this few I'm able to mention on this video is enough for you to step out and include beetroot when you shop next for your fruits and vegetables. Okay. I want to see that. Tag me.